Bam. Do I look a lot cooler now? You do. <laughs> There's a place where you really live, where you can do what you love to do. Whatever you do, get there with Continental Tires. Hey, it's Andrea. I'm back, but this time in Gunnison, Colorado. I'm about to get a mountain biking lesson from Continental athlete, dad, and mountain biking Hall of Famer, Dave Weems. Seriously, this guy is in the mountain biking Hall of Fame. You ready? For what you do. Hi. Andrea? Yes, Dave, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, come on in. Thanks for having me, I'm you so bet. excited. Oh, we're gonna have fun. I've never been mountain biking, so I'm kind of a little scared. Is it scary, right. is it dangerous? It's gonna be fun. It might be a little scary. Okay. Let's go check out the bikes. All right, let's do it. This is the shop. This is where I'm able to work on the bicycles. And in fact, we've got your bike right here. This is my Ooh. wife Susan's bike, Susan DiMatte. She won the bronze medal in Atlanta in 1996. The Olympics? And the Olympics, yes. Whoa. Back in the day, there's some old photos of oh, us there. Wow. And, uh, that's you, that's her? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at these. <laughs> So this is... The wall of shame. There's no shame in the wall of shame, it's just a play on words, but mm -hmm. uh, it started here and it's something that I've done, I don't know, maybe all my life where I'll just pin stuff up and, and uh, it's memorabilia of sorts. So uh, Susan, of course, at the Olympics over here, and there's Snoop Dogg, I don't know what that's gonna take me back. I just, <laughs> I just like that. I should throw that away, I should throw all this stuff away, <laughs> but I don't. I, I think just, it's cool you keep it though. I just I stack it in there and, and how about some mountain biking? Okay, let's do it. Are you ready to ride? I'm excited, yeah. To the mountains. Oh, so where exactly are we headed? We're headed to Crested Butte and the Crested Butte Resort, okay. which is about 30 miles north of Gunnison. The trails with names like 401 and 403 and Deer Creek are, are classic trails in mountain biking circles. Yeah, I see, it's so beautiful. Like, I, I, okay, I like New York City, but after being here, I'm like, why don't I move somewhere that's actually <laughs> not so crazy populated? <laughs> Before we actually get on the ride, let's just go over a couple of quick things to think about. Ooh, it's been a while since I biked. Has it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're gonna do great. This is what we call the attack position. When you stand up, yeah. your chin is up, your elbows are bent. All right, are you ready for some single track? Yeah, let's do it. All right, here we go, diving into the woods. What drew you to mountain biking? When I came back to Gunnison, I was able to take the mountain bike and just explore the public lands all around Gunnison mm -hmm. and uh, had a great time doing it. I like to race. Uh, I like to be competitive, and mountain bike racing was a brand new sport at that time. And uh, some of my buddies were, were doing some mountain bike racing and jumped in a couple races, and uh, the rest is history, I guess. Oh, that was a blast. We're race to the car. Oh, no, <laughs> wait. Attack mode, race to the car. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> That was fun. Well, that was mean. You did great. What do you think? It was so fun. It was a lot harder than I thought. You did but great. But I feel like I'm really happy that I pulled through and kept at it, because right away it was very intimidating. It's <laughs> hard. Shaking. Well, you weren't a mountain biker. And yeah. you, you listened to the techniques we talked about. You put them into action, and, and you ripped it. it you're awesome. a great. You're a great coach. Thank you. That was a blast. It was a little bit intimidating at first, but thanks to Dave for letting me see your life as a mountain biker, and I can't wait to do it again. Till next time, for what you do. Let's roll. Crescent Butte, we out! Oh.